Today I'd like to welcome you guys to Batesville, Indiana. We're at a trail called Brunswoods Trail. Now today's venture is going to be a little different because it's going to be very windy. The wind is gusting up to 45 miles an hour. And we just had a rain so we can only take a small part of this trail. But you never know where the venture is going to go. And sad to say I have to wear my hoodie. But if you really look at me right here, I don't know if you can see me. I'm in shorts too, yeah, because I'm sick and tired of wearing pants. I got used to the warm weather and yeah, you know, you know. So today's adventure may be quite interesting with this wind. Yeah, let's give it a shot anyway. You want to? Did I fail to mention today, temperature is also 40 degrees, so it's a little nippy. Now this is the paved part of this trail. There's also dirt trails, but we won't be able to hit the dirt trails. This walking place <laughs> has rules. It wants you to stay off the dirt trails when it's after a rain. I can understand that. I, I, I get it. I get it. So we're going to stay on the paved trail and see where the adventure takes us. And I hope you guys are hearing me because this wind is just a howling. Holy. Guys, there's a deer. Two deer, three deer. There's three deer over there. Look, guys. Should we let the people pass this? Yeah. Hello. Thanks for As you see, there's little signs and my wife tells me they put these out here for the little kids to enjoy the walkway. So I don't know, they look pretty cool. It's not a bad trail. I wouldn't mind walking something like this early in the mornings. You know, on my regular walk, like I said, it's a paved path. And it do have some dirt trails, but we won't be allowed on them today. But it's not a bad little trail. This trail, if I'm not mistaken, is semi-new. Yeah. But it's quite beautiful. Let's get some scenery. One, two. Since it is a paved trail, it does take you out by the main road, but it's not a heavy used road. Still quite beautiful. 
it's not a long trail all in all we i think it's about maybe a mile long yeah it's not a long trail but that's okay though we was hoping today to hit all the trails here we was hoping to hit the dirt trails which i think the dirt trails is right over across the street it will stop and get that in a minute we was hoping to hit them trails today but we're going to obey the rules and stay off the trails when they're muddy of course you know angie and i we like mud <laughs> it seems like every trail we go on is muddy but the rules here they don't want you to do it and we're going to obey the rules right over there is where the trails are for the dirt trails and that right there is a sign I guess they hang out there whenever it rains and says it's closed. So I don't know. Let's continue on. It is quite beautiful through here. We will come back and do the dirt trails another time. Right now we're going to stay on the paved trail and see what we got. This tells the story of the lady that actually owned this property. What she did was she donated this property to the city of Batesville, but she wanted to keep it a nature preserve. And that's one of the reasons they don't want you to walk on the trails when it's muddy. And this is weird, me walking to the right of you. That is true. Yeah, because normally when we walk, I'm always on the left side of you, and that's how I walk with anybody I walk with. I'm on the left side. But yeah, we're just gonna continue on, and when we get done with this trail, we're going to drive on over or just walk on over. Hell, what we have to, we just walk back. Yeah. That way we get more mileage in. <laughs> yeah, we just want to walk on over across the street and get a little bit of the, the uh, dirt trails, but we won't be going on them. We want to obey the rules, guys. Always obey the rules they set out for you on the trails, no matter where you are. The rules are there for a reason. I have to remind myself, listen, that's the wind, guys. That is the wind. And I have to remind myself whenever I walk with Angie that when we're ever on payment like this, I got to slow down. Even though I'm in my hiking shoes, when I walk, I walk at a speed. And by the way, as you notice, I don't have my everyday glasses on. I have my walking glasses on today. That's uh, something else I need to start changing because when I'm in my everyday glasses, uh, I don't know. Whenever I do the trails, this might be weird, but whenever I do the trails or I do any kind of walking, I always wear another set of sunglasses instead of my everyday prescription glasses. It's just something about the prescription glasses. I don't know. It just don't feel right to walk with them. But I think we may be coming to the end. So what we're going to do is we're going to turn around head back and goes the other way. That way we can get some mileage in. All right, looks like we're coming out, so we're not sure how we want to do this. Actually, I got an idea. We could go up this way. Or we just go back the way we came. Go back the way we came. All right, we made it to the end. Now we're going to head back the other way and walk what we've already walked. I like it when I do some videoing or I'm doing a vlog entry and there's somebody standing or sitting nearby me. I like the looks I get. 
I'm always hoping they're going to ask me what I'm doing. Because if they ask me what I'm doing, I'm going to present a card to my channel. And then they ask me what my channel is about. That's easy. See, before I made the changeover in my videos, I was like, well, I was a vlogger. I did some skits and whatnots. Now I can tell them they're adventure videos. All right, we're getting ready to pass somebody. I have to mention, though, for it being an extremely windy, cooler day, there's a lot of people on this trail. I mean, there's a whole bunch of people on this trail. <laughs> that kind of makes me happy to see a trail being used as much as it is. You know, I think everybody needs to get out into nature and <sighs> leave their stress in the wind. Just get out there and become part of what God intends to be. That tree is beautiful. Oh, you all want to see the tree? Let's show you the tree. Oh, look how beautiful this tree is. Oh my Lord. Holy. You can see we're starting to green up around here. Spring is definitely in the air. That's for sure. You can't feel it today, huh? The owner of the property was Lena Brum. I hope I didn't dicker her name over earlier. But from what I just gathered from my lovely wife, developers wanted to buy this property, but she would not sell it to them. She wanted to keep it natural. She wants to keep it the way it is, so this is why they did what they did. And this is why it comes with rules. Okay, we're gonna cross the street, actually two streets, and we're gonna get over where the walking trails are. We won't be hitting them, but we're just gonna get a looks, a look-see. Sound good to you all? We're going after a look-see, hun. A look-see. A look-see, yeah, a look-see. I like look-sees. Look-sees. Look Oh, this is quite beautiful. Holy, this is nice. sign right next to me says it's closed <laughs> obviously but yeah we're practicing for a thumbnail shot we're gonna do at the end of this but wow look at the beauty oh my gosh mm, 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 mm. trail four closed trail two is open though yeah but it says to stay off on half that range yeah we can't get on it but coming soon guys I would say coming soon to a video near you, but coming soon to One Bubba Mike One Productions. We will be coming back here and doing the, doing the trails. <laughs> I didn't know what to call them for a minute there. In the next couple weeks, we're gonna come back here and do the dirt trails. We hit every single one of them. Today, obviously it's not feasible. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this footage. Now, the next day, you're going to see a different type of footage. We're going to go to Liberty Park Reservoir. 
We're also going to get some footage of Liberty Park. This is a place I fished at. I do have in my videos from way back when. But this time we're going to walk all the way around the reservoir. And I guarantee that's when it's going to be really, really windy. Because there's nothing there to block the wind. But for now, we're closing it out. But tune in next time. We're going to show you Liberty Park Reservoir and Liberty Park. The adventure continues. It never stops with us. Just because we're not able to hit the dirt trails, that's okay. And just in case the adventure, just like my last fishing adventure, just in case it doesn't work out, it doesn't matter. It's still an adventure. So guys, until next time, we see you on our next adventure. Come on. Let's get out of here. That's right. GoPro, stop recording.